Today, we're gonna try to destroy an anvil. Here we have the Harbor Freight 55 pound anvil that we did a little bit of a homemade upgrade on. Threw this A2 top on it, welded it to the cast iron anvil to turn this piece of crap anvil into a slightly less crappy anvil. Uh, truth be told, I'm waiting for this top to pop off any day because this cast iron does not weld very well. Uh, but it's held up, it actually forges. It does okay forging. But we decided that we don't really need it and we're gonna beat the crap out of it. So, enjoy. Cancel contact. She hasn't died yet. Hammer time! <laughs> it's a soft cast iron. Just dense like crazy. A2 where I got it on the edge, dented. We knew this thing wasn't perfectly hardened. It was a little bit cold when we hardened it. Still harder than the cast, but yeah, not quite as uh, not quite as hard as it should be. Welds haven't split yet. That looks like a split well. Look at that. Woo. There she is. <laughs> Busted. Yeah, you can see it stuck to the A2 fine, but that cast iron, it's just crap. We used 7018 to weld this, which was not the right filler rod. A nickel rod would have been much better, but still. So as you can see, we've just made a mess. The anvil's topless now, and it's about to lose its horn in a second. So we dehorned the anvil, but we're not done cutting this thing. Uh, there's a little hole in the side that I've been curious about since day one. So we're gonna cut the side of it and uh, see what they're trying to hide inside this anvil. What the hell? We ain't done yet. So if you like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.